Okay, so we got another Tropolis review for you today, and this time it's Catlord732 who kindly provided his PSN account quite a while back. And you can also have your account reviewed just by leaving your PSN profile account down below in the comment section. Just be mindful, there is a very high number on the list currently. I am going to speed up the process by doing more of these videos on a regular basis while not neglecting other content in the future. So as always, I've already put it into alphabetical, platinums only, and straight off the bat, the first thing I'm seeing is 93.91% completion. So I'm excited to see what this, uh, this account has to offer, basically. Uh, so straight off the bat, Alan Wake, brilliant game. One that I've played myself, haven't got the platinum. Um, I believe I still need to do two playthroughs on it because I, play, I played through it once, just normal. Uh, and then I've got the hardest difficulty and the collectibles. Um, not on my mind for the you know the foreseeable future, but in you know who knows. Uh, Assassin's Creed Brotherhood, nice. And Assassin's Creed 2, as I've said in previous videos, Assassin's Creed 2. I think that was the, my first ever platinum, but it was on a much older account. I know that I definitely got the uh, 100 feathers, um, but I don't know what happened to that account. I must, maybe it was when I went over to Xbox, I, I must have lost the password or something and then came back to PlayStation. What can I say, I'm a klutz. Uh, Black Flag, nice, look at that percentage, 5.37%. That That's impressive. Um, and to be honest, I played Black Flag. I played a lot, I put a lot of hours into that. Never got anywhere near the Platinum. I wasn't trying for the Platinum, but I put a lot of time into it. So, fair play on that one. Uh, Mirage, yeah, I mean, it's got a, I'm actually shocked. I know that it's an easy Platinum, but I'm shocked that it's that high still. Um, Assassin's Creed Origins, okay, so, I'm guessing Catlord, you, you really enjoy your Assassin's Creeds. Um, not my kind of game in truth like i've played a couple of them but as i've said in numerous videos in the past once i play one game i have to have like a massive break until i play the same game but in a different setting like it, it's one of the reasons why i've never why well, i haven't completed god of war ragnarok even though i, I completed and platinumed the 2018 god of war it, it's too soon for me i just i can't get into it uh, but nice fair play Revelations as well, Rogue, Syndicate, Unity, that one being uh, only 10.25%, so I'm guessing that's, no, yeah, sorry, I, I looked at Syndicate 16.94 then, I'm losing my, my marbles already, but yeah, that's a lot of Assassin's Creed's and fair play, um, Unity I'm guessing is tougher than all of the others, but not quite as tough as Black Flag. Then we go on to Batman, Arkham Asylum, Arkham City, and Arkham Knight. Here, here. I've, I've just seen the next load. Like, yeah. <laughs> what can I say? Okay, first we got Chivalry 2. 3.15%. I'm actually shocked that that's so low. Is that a difficult game, or is it just because it, it was on... I believe it came on to... PlayStation Plus, so maybe loads of people played it, but not many people finished it. But yeah, and then, I mean, I just knocked my little pair of earphones off, but Crash Bandicoot, Crash Bandicoot 2, Crash Bandicoot Warped, and Crash Bandicoot 4, all platinumed. I am shocked that the percentages are as high as they are, but they are still very low. I've tried... Uh, the first Crash Bandicoot. I can't do it. I really can't. Skill issue across the board. You've done all four, including Crash Bandicoot 4, which I've seen the I've seen the trophy list. Absolutely horrendous. But you've done it, so it's like I might as well just end the video now. I'm, I'm guessing that you haven't got. Well, actually, you know what? I'm willing to be surprised. I have just seen something a little bit below, which I'm going to gush over in a second. Crisis Core, uh, Final Fantasy VII Reunion, nice. I know that's uh, a, I wouldn't say a tough one, but a very grindy one. And then, I mean, you are a man of culture, or woman of culture. You are a person of culture. Uh, I 
love Danganronpa. Absolutely love it. Animes, the games. Um, I, I can see that you haven't got V3 though. Is that because it's a difficult platinum or just haven't got around to it yet? But I know that these platinums are sickeningly hard. Ultra Despair Girls, not so much. And I guess the 20% on that kind of shows that. But Dragon Romper 1 and 2, fair play. Like, I'm just going to keep clapping all, all the way through this video, aren't I? Uh, Days Gone, yep, yeah, awesome platinum. Um, of course, I haven't got it, but it is one on my list that I want to revisit one day. Death Store, nice. Uh, Descender, Descenders, 1.15%. Okay, now, so far that's your lowest one, from what I can tell. I don't know what it consists of, I've never played the game. But if it's only that low, if it's that very low of a percentage, I'm guessing that it's... It's either super difficult or just extremely grindy. But again, fair play. Clap of the hand. Wow. Okay. I, I am going to continue to be impressed. Devil May Cry, Devil May Cry 2, Devil May Cry 3, Devil May Cry 4, Devil May Cry 5, and DMC Devil May Cry. All platinumed. Oh my god. Well, whoever keeps messaging me, stop. You are interrupting me while I'm looking in awe at these trophies. Like, I, I, I'm at the point now where I'm looking at this and I'm thinking to myself, yeah, any platinum that you would want to partake or attempt, you are, you've are you got the skill to do it. Five and six, uh, five and f four and five, 2.96, 2.59. You even did the DLC. Mate, hands down, like, no ifs or buts about it, as things stand, this is, like, the, the trophy list that is really just blowing my mind. This is nuts. Um, Dying Light, again, uh, I, I almost had that. If it wasn't for the quarantine zones bugging on me, I would have gone on to get this uh, platinum trophy. Uh, and maybe I'll go back to it at some point, but I know it's a, a long... A long one and fair play. Uh, Endling, Extinction is Forever, nice. Evil West, nice. I think I got one trophy on that and I was just like, this game isn't for me. Like, I'm not saying it's a bad game. It might have been too soon for me. Like, maybe I played a, a similar game, but uh, one trophy and I was like, nah, I can't be bothered. Uh, Far Cry Primal, nice. 25.11%, quite high actually. I was expecting it to be lower. Uh, Final Fantasy VII Remake, nice, 13.11%. That, that's one that I probably should be uh, going back to myself, to be honest. Uh, everybody's favourite Samurai game, Ghost of Tsushima, 37.42%. Higher than I was expecting, but I know that it's uh, probably the most one of the most uh, platinum games, I believe. Uh, God of War, nice. Grid Legends, Nice, 11.11%, quite low. Heavenly Bodies, 7.68%. I have no idea what that consists of. Um, I don't even know what the, the uh, game is. But I am going to check it out after your trophy list, because I'm intrigued. Never heard of that game before. Uh, Horizon Zero Dawn, nice. Hot Wheels Unleashed. I'm a wow, I'm actually shocked that that's so low. I um I actually started Hot Wheels Unleashed uh, a couple of months back, and I felt like it was a bit a bit grindy, but I was still chipping away at it, and then I just stopped. If I knew it was that low of a percentage, I'd have probably carried on. But fair play, nice as well. Human fall flat. Me. I, I'm actually speechless. Like, it, I can talk for England, but this trophy list is actually making me stop in my tracks. Like, the words just aren't coming out. Uh, Lego DC Super Villains, nice as well. And then another few Legos. So we got Lego Harry Potter, 1 to 4. Lego Harry Potter, 5 to 7. Lego Marvel Super Heroes, Super Heroes 2. Marvel's Avengers. And 
Ninjago. Ninjago. Uh, the movie game. I mean, everyone knows what Lego games consist of, but I've, I've got two. And that's it. Uh, because, to put it bluntly, they do kind of bore me. But, fair play for getting all of these. And... Who knows, maybe I just haven't played the right Lego game yet, because the only two I've ever played is the uh, Lego Movie, which was because I got it free with my PlayStation 4 when I first brought it. And then I thought, might as well do the Lego Movie too. Maybe probably not the best Lego games, maybe I need to do another one in the future. Uh, Mafia, nice. I have actually been told recently to do this, and I have been looking into it. Um, so I'm, I've seen the trophy list. Um, shocked that it's 21.38% but again another nice platinum uh, Marvel's Guardian of the Galaxy I I'm never ever going to say anything negative about that game because I loved it got the platinum as well brilliant game chef's kiss uh, Marvel's Spider-Man nice then Miles Morales it's, it's on my list um, you know it it's when I say games are on my list, sometimes they are on my list for, you know, content. Sometimes they're on my list to just platinum offline. Like I, I, but Mars Morales is a game that I want to platinum in the future. 4.0% um, Meet Your Maker. I'm shocked at that percentage because I know that that was a free game, wasn't it? Okay. Nice, again. I don't know what it consists of, but fair play. And then you got Metro 2033 Redux, Metro Exodus, and Metro Last Light Redux. Fair effing play. They, like, I enjoy the Metro games, but they are pretty difficult. Uh, and, to, I mean, platinumed all three. Like, how many more times am you, um, is your list going to make me clap? I'm only at M. Uh, Minecraft Dungeons, nice. Mirror, Mirror's Edge Catalyst, very nice. Little, uh, what's what's the word I'm looking for? Little bit of a sour note, Mirror's Edge Catalyst for me. I brought it a while back, and then I just never got around to playing it. And I believe the day that I, it was either the day or the day after, or day before, um, I finally decided, you know what, I'm going to play that today. Found out that the servers were was uh, turned off, and I was like, oh. I mean, obviously, I can still play the game. I just wouldn't be able to get the platinum. And, and to be honest, I'll play anything. I don't care about uh, my own list, but I love looking at other people's lists, especially when it's like this. My God. Murdered Soul Suspect, a personal uh, one that I personally got myself. Not the greatest game in my opinion, but fair play, you've got that one as well. Need for Speed Heat and Rivals, nice and double nice. Um, oh, Persona 5, 9.11%. I mean, Rivals is 7.28, but you know, I, I know what goes into Persona 5. That is a long ass trophy, so fair play. Uh, one year and eight months, so I'm guessing you may have gone back and did a second playthrough. Uh, Persona Strikers, that is one that will always um, have a, a, another one that's got a sour note for me. I think I was two trophies away from platinum, platinum Persona Five Strikers, and that was before I was a platinum hunter. Um, I can't, I can't be bothered to go back and try it all just for those two trophies. Uh, Red Dead Redemption Two, two point five one percent. Not my kind of game. I, I, I have tried it but nah, it was too maybe it was too soon after uh, red dead one but 2.51 percent let's give it up uh resident evil 2 nice surprised that the percentage is hot that high on it but you did do the dlc as well same with resident evil 7 one that i've got the only resident evil i've got at the moment another one coming soon uh but resident evil 7 10.82 percent Damn it, that's gone up. I'm pretty sure when I when I uh, platinum that it was at like seven percent. Um, but you've done the DLC on that as well. Rocket League, nice. 
Rocket League's another one. I've got I've got a lot of trophies in it, but nowhere near the platinum. But I suppose I could always go back and, and get it. Um, Sackboy, a big adventure. Nice. 8.76%. Scarlet Nexus, bad boy game. Um, 20... I'm actually shocked that that's quite so high. 20.09% of people have platinumed it. So like one in five. I'm actually shocked. I'm not one of them. But it is a, ba it is a banger of a game. Um, Slime Rancher. Nice. 7.10%. Um, interestingly, you did it in two weeks and five days. Because this is a game that I brought recently. Um, I've never played it. I don't know what the trophy list consists of. But I have brought it recently. And I do want to play it. Uh, Sonic Frontiers. Nice. Um, I haven't got this Platinum. I'm pretty far into the game. Uh, I just... I got, I got a bit bored of it to be honest uh, and I'm I'm a huge Sonic fan like I, I've played every Sonic game ever made so far um, yeah I, I just got bored of it then you got the three Spyros I'm guessing all from the Reignited Trilogy got one got two haven't got three but they all consist of the same thing but still you've got them nice uh, Star Wars Jedi Fallen Order nice again and another game I've played but I just couldn't get into it myself personally. I'm I'm not a don't get the pitchforks out. I'm not a Star Wars fan. Not because I think it's rubbish. I just I've never watched it. And even though people have told me, dude, watch it. I just I've never got the time to to watch it. It's very rare that I've got free time. It's usually spent on YouTube doing videos, playing games, uh, spending time with my son, going to work, spending time with the missus. Of course. Misses and the kids just can't just leave me alone sometimes. That's a joke, by the way. I, want, I, I love my kid. Um, Stray, beautiful. I mean, I, I've, I've done that one recently, but hold the phone. Forget about Stray. Forget about every single other trophy so far. Super Meat Boy. Super freaking Meat Boy. 0.41%. I'm guessing that is the rarest trophy. Oh my god. Three months, one week. I, this, this is the kind of trophy, uh, platinum trophy, or game, that I reckon I wouldn't even be able to complete, never mind get the platinum trophy on it. Hands down. Amazing. Then we've got Super Hot. Nice. I'm shocked that that's so low, but then I don't really know what the uh, trophy list consists of, so maybe there's some hard ones in there, but 3.97%, another banger. Uh, Tales of Iron, nice. Uh, I got that digital, digitally, I believe. I think we all got it for PS Plus, um, or maybe. But uh, I'm shocked that it's so high. Maybe that's one I need to look at, yeah, because, you know, skill issue for myself. I can't do these uh, absolutely ridiculously hard ones. Uh, Callisto Protocol, nice. Again, I'm shocked that's so high. I know the game's a piece of piss, but I'm shocked that that many people have actually gone for it. But again, nice, you got it. And I know I just highlighted it, but the evil within, Akuma mode. Like, this, this is a this is a platinum that I've actually been considering. I've played The Witcher 1, I've, I've played The Witcher 2, I loved both of them. This is a trophy, that a, a game that I have considered going for the platinum for. And I'm like really, really like trying to psych myself up to actually go for it. Because I know Akuma mode is disgusting. Um, and then we got The Witcher 3, Wild Hunt, Game of the Year edition. So that's all the DLCs and everything as well, which you've done. Um, I'm again shocked that it's so high. One in ten people that play the game have actually uh, got the platinum. Then we got Trek to Yumi. Nice. Uh, Uncharted 1, 2, and 3, I'm guessing that is. Um, 14, 17, 17. Nice. Three platinums that are on my list to attempt in the future, uh, but not anytime soon. Uh, I think I need to get a bit better, have more skill before I tackle those. Uh, Unravel, nice. 
I know that Unravel 2 is like kind of ridiculously low percentage, but Unravel 1 is still a nice Platinum to have. Vanquish, I don't think I've ever seen ban anyone Platinum Vanquish so far. Although, to be fair, there's been loads on your list that I haven't seen anyone else have so far. Um, but fair play, Vanquish, banger of a game. Watchdogs and literally like 20 minutes before pressing record on this, I uh, was actually recommended or requested to Platinum Yakuza 0. So I I'm not looking forward to looking into that trophy list, but 4.67% very nice my guy <laughs> i mean i feel like this video is going to be awful because it's just me gushing over so many of these trophies oh, and that, that's just amazing you i mean i know that i only ever really pay attention to the platinums but the fact that your first trophy was danganronpa <laughs> like straight up i love it so as always, we're going to go through the milestones. So, first platinum, Spider Man. Yeah, why not? 10th uh, platinum, Crash Bandicoot 4 was your 10th. Oh my god. Uh, Batman, Plat uh, Batman, Arkham Asylum, or Ar Arkham City. Christ. This this is how good your list is. It's just sending me fucking doolally. Uh, yep, yeah, 20th. 30th was Yakuza 0. 40th was uh, The Witcher 3. 50th was Red Dead Redemption 2. Uh, your fastest platinum was Endling, Endling Extinction is Forever. 75th platinum was Super Meat Boy. And your latest platinum was Lego Harry Potter years 5 to 7. And then we go on to the rarest trophies. Super Meat Boy, Super Meat Boy, Super Meat Boy and Super Meat Boy. And I've just noticed you got some in your trophy cabinet. So Slime, uh, Slime Rancher, The Evil Within and Stray are the three Platinums that you've highlighted. Why have you not got the Super Meat Boy one there? Although I guess it's already on the page near the top. So kind of makes sense. Um, I don't usually do this, but I'm actually going to put all. And I'm going to take it off alphabetical. Because let's just move that ad I'm actually interested in what you're working on next okay remake uh, medieval remake decent game well yeah so thank you very much cat lord for uh, submitting your account that list was absolutely fucking insane um, yeah Clearly skilled and epic gamer, no questions. But if anybody else wants their list to be reviewed in the future, then just leave the name down below in the comment section and I will get back to you. Just a heads up, I have had people mention that their comments have disappeared. Uh, numerous people, including some of my own friends. Um, therefore, if, you, if your uh, comment doesn't appear straight away, try again because I do want to review all the lists that I can. Every viewer, every subscriber, uh, you know, I'm, I'm thankful for every single one of you. So of course, I want to pay it back by making sure I do everybody's list. So thank you very much for watching everybody and see you next time.